All right, hey guys, I'm back with a new It's a Week series. So, um, I knew I was probably going to switch this week out before Easter come, but I'm like, let me hurry up and do this week in case anybody wanted to go get this. Now, this is the Sensational Fashion Week. Y'all know Sensational been out for like years now, like over seven years now. I don't know why I'm, I always find myself back getting a Sensational wig or getting like those old, old, old Outre wigs when I can go and get the newer ones. But somehow, the Sensational wigs, you can always like jazz them up or fix them up. So, yes, I'm back with the new Sensational wig. It is the Fashion Week. It is the... Elsa in the color one and it was literally only twenty dollars like no tax nothing it was literally it was literally just $19.99 um this is the Elsa wig this is from sensational it's like I literally passed this wig like 30 times because I did not I was just like I don't know if I want to put this wig on I really don't know like I don't know if I'm gonna look old or nothing but let me just tell y'all about it and I'm gonna be completely honest it says it's a quick wig and you can style it in 60 seconds. No, you really can't. Honestly, this wig, it took me a long time to get adjusted to. You guys know I was wearing this for like two days before I came on and did the review because I wanted to know for sure if I wanted to do a review on this wig because when I first got this wig, the back part of the wig is really, really long. Like, really, really long. So, you know what I did? I cut it. It was literally to like right here. And I cut it really, really short. And when I cut it, it still has the same pattern. So if you cut it, it's not going to go away or the pattern is not going to be there. It's still there. Now, um, I had to get one. I really wanted to try out the color, but I'm like, let me just try out one first. They do come in different colors. These are the colors that they come in, like blonde colors. It's really not all one color like they all mix colors except for if you get black like i did now i did cut it to customize it to my liking because it was flipped up in the back like it was flipped up in the back and i kind of like just like took my hands and layered it honestly it's like another mommy wig it's a super cute affordable like messy bob wig the bangs were like all over the place the bangs were to the right to the left so i kind of like Put my bangs in the front where I like them because I am a bang girl. So, I didn't have no problem with the bang. And I knew bang was going to, like, save the style. But I kind of, like, just layered it. And as you can see, it looks really, really cute when you layer it and give it, like, that oomph. Like, you really have to give this wig an oomph. Like, you really got to style it to your liking because, I mean, the the... Like I tell y'all all the time, the models don't do it no justice. Because that's why I walk past this model. But like I told y'all, don't walk past the model. Get the wig, especially if it's a cheap wig. Get the wig, try it on, wear it for a few days, and then, you know, see if you can customize it and stuff like that. So I wore it to see if I liked it longer at the bottom. I really didn't like it too long. I felt like the bottom was way too long. I don't like when they make messy bobs and then the bottom is too long and it's like, it was looking wiggish, like it was flipping up. So that's the kind that I did not like about this wig was it was flipping up and it was looking wiggish, like when I would walk. But as you can see, I did it up though. Like like, I cut it really, really nice and layered it. And then I just, like, made, like, a messy bob and fixed my bangs. I'm going to just be completely honest. It's, it looks nice when you don't have no makeup on. But I feel like when you have the makeup on, it gives the wig, like, that oomph junction. So, I knew I was going to have to come on here and do my makeup for this review. So, you guys can see how this wig look when you have your makeup done and you just customize it to your liking. But so far, it was only $20. It was another mommy wig for me because you guys know I'm a mother and I need a wig where I can just throw it on and be out or, you know, run my errands and stuff like that. So, it was $20. Like, it was sensational from years ago. I don't know how I picked this up, but my hair supply, I did get it at the hair supply. Um, they might, I don't, I, I honestly don't know if they had the older Sensational wig, because this is the old, you can tell from the packaging. I guess Sensational package is like this, but I don't know if hair types or wig types or Sam's Beauty going to have this wig. You might have to look on like eBay or Amazon, but I'll link some of the, um, the websites that you can order this wig. It's really, really cute. Like, if you're a bang girl like me, you can go ahead and pick up this wig. I got this at the beauty supply because I was actually coming on vacation. I was like, 
I need a quick wig. And I was like, okay, well, let me try this wig out at the beauty supply. I asked her if I could feel it, feel the texture, and she let me feel it. And sensational wigs, texture is the bomb. Like, do you guys see this? Like, it has so much body. Like, I didn't know that sensational wigs had so much body. Like, this wig is, like, slaying, like... It has so much body. Like, I love when I can just walk and my wig is going with me. I cannot stand a stiff bob. Like, I cannot stand a stiff bob. Once, but the only thing about straight wigs is after, like, two weeks, they get real stiff. So, I wouldn't wear this after two weeks. Like, I, you, you guys know I'm not going to keep this in. You guys know that. Because after two weeks, it get real stiff. It don't move. The back gets, like, real, real dry and stiff. And it's like... Because I was watching another video on a YouTuber and she was telling you how you can protect your wigs and keep your wigs for a long time and she was putting them in plastic bags. And I would I was doing that with my old wigs. I was putting them in plastic bags and one of my wigs, the blonde wig that I did a review for like months ago, you know the blonde bob I did. And it was like the curl pattern was still there in the front but the back was so netted up like it was terrible. So guys... Throw out, if you got a straight wig, you want you might as well just throw it out. Especially if you pay like $20 for it. I don't expect a $20 wig to be popping for a month. I really, really don't. Now, if I paid like $45 or $60 for a wig, then I'd be like, okay, we're going to try to wash this or whatever. But I don't wash. I don't flat iron this. No, I did not have to flat iron this. You see, I'm running my hands through it. I don't even have a brush with me for this review. I'm just running my hands through it because I feel like it styles more. When I'm running my hands through it, I like the messy feel. Don't mind the dryer, guys. I like the messy feel of this wig. I really, really do. And I cut it so it can be to my liking because I did not like the bottom because I felt like the bottom was flipping up. But anyway, this was just like a quick little review and the cons and the pros that I like about this wig. Um, it's really like a two-week wear. You do have to customize it to your liking. If you like it all the way at the bottom, then that's for you. But I didn't like it at the bottom. I didn't like it flipped up so... Like, you know how wigs flip up at the bottom and you don't want that type of style? No. But I didn't want, I wanted to get this review up because I didn't know if I wanted to switch this out, if I wanted to wear this for Easter because it's Easter week. And it is Tuesday. And it's a really cute, like, simple... On the go, it is 100% premium fiber. On the back of the pack, it says how to wash it, brush it. Do not wash this. Do not do not flat iron this. I will not. Mm -mm. I will not. I will not. Your wig will be a high ass mess. It would be terrible. But these are the colors, and this is just the front of it. They do have some colors in there, like mixed colors, like 1B30 or like a 1B99J. But I wanted to get black because I feel like black would just be like. It. So, um, that's it. It's really like a instant sensational wig if you like it long at the bottom, but I did cut it so I can get some layers in here. And I guess I'm going to end this little vlog review and I will talk to you guys in my next video. If you want to pick it up, I'm going to list some like websites that might have it or you might could just go to your local beauty supply. Because I honestly, I be wanting my wigs then and now because I be everywhere doing so much stuff. So I be need I I'm just like the type of person that I need my hair done. I cannot walk around looking a hot mess. I have to have my hair done. That's why I like wigs because it's so much variety with wigs. You can switch them out, colors. You can do whatever you want with wigs, but they do get kind of annoying because when you wearing wigs, it's like especially synthetic wigs. You can't wear them too long because they're going to get messed up, and it's like all that money we would spend on these wigs go out the drain. Go out the drain. So I do buy cheaper wigs because I feel like with cheaper wigs, I can switch them out when I want. Because guess what? I only pay $15 or $20. But that's just my view on it. I try to style it and have it the way I want it to wear for these reviews. Because a lot of YouTubers go on YouTube and they do wig reviews and they don't style it or they don't tell you how they did it. They just basically plop it on their head and that's it. And that's no shade, but... I just like to wear my wigs for a few days, style it, do my makeup, so you guys can see how you're going to look with the wig. Like, you don't want to buy a wig from a YouTuber or something like that, and you get mad at me or come back in my comments saying, I bought this wig and it don't look right. So, I want y'all to know that you can customize it and you can layer it to your liking, and I do like it because it's an on-the-go wig, and it was only $19.99. So, I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye!